Each VSI hydro seeder comes standard with a garden hose fill connection. All you do is thread this onto the end of the hose, remove the cap, and clamp it on. Then you can turn on your water and you can walk away from your tank without fear of the hose falling out of the tank. Another way to fill your hydro seeder is with our optional pond suction kit. It includes a 15 foot suction hose and a strainer basket that cam locks on. Install the strainer basket to keep rocks and debris out of your, out of your hydro seeder and make sure that the strainer basket is fully submerged in whatever your body of water you're pulling from. Now make sure your valves are in the right configuration and start the engine. Make sure to check local regulations on if you have to pull permits to pull from any body of water. Now we're going to go over how you use the standard pond suction feature on your hydro seeder to self-fill from a bulk water storage tank such as this one. Each suction hose comes standard with a two inch female cam lock connection. Make sure your tank valve is open on your bulk storage tank. Now we're going to go over the valve configurations for utilizing the pond suction feature on your VSI hydro seeder. First, you want to make sure your tank suction valve is in the closed position. Next, you want to make sure your agitation valve is in the open position. And the last valve, your pond suction valve, should also be in the open position. Now you're ready to start your engine. First, you want to make sure your switch is in the on position. Set your choke. Once your tank is three quarters of the way full of water, you can shut your pond suction valve and then reopen your tank suction valve. Then you can begin the mixing process.